Oh, I'm sorry. Can I say that? You just did. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you can. <laughs> sorry, Mom. Well, it's kind of, it's kind of like Stump Boy. It's all about Stump Boy over there. <laughs> It is. <laughs> <laughs> it's all about stuff, boy. I love that he did the Randy Orton thing and the and the and the and the cable. You're gonna hurt yourself. Careful. <laughs> <laughs> pull a muscle. Did you stretch? You pull a muscle. That's right. <laughs> He's pulling a muscle. So okay, well you guys are going back to Smedley's in a couple weeks. Or next next weekend, weekend, Saturday, if she messages me back on Facebook. So that means that you essentially might be able to be in studio for Reno next Sunday, maybe. She's awesome. Yeah, because yeah, I think we're staying the night again. Because we'll have to see. And if Kenzie will be here, and I think Kenzie and Bird yeah. are going to come up on a guitar game. <laughs> That'd be great. We do it for free, you know. Yeah. You know, you know what you guys need to do. You guys need to. Uh, what the hell is that? What's going on? Um, you guys need to figure out a way to get a, like a hotel sponsorship. Right. That'd be a good idea. I don't know. It's a it's a ghost. Maybe it's KKK. You know you know what's Maybe. funny. You know well I. Oh, I we supposedly sl- slept in a ho- haunted hotel room last night. Yes. You were in a haunted hotel room. Supposedly, last night. Yes. but I don't know. Say, they were really drunk. We will so. not say what hotel because I don't want the poor lady to lose her job. But, uh, <laughs> we did audio and and video <laughs> and. Uh, not. We haven't even watched it yet, so I don't know if we are listening to anything. But it's, they- it's supposedly people that stay in that room most of the time check out in the middle of the night, go to a different room, and they hear when there's no one in that room, the people next door hear noises from that room, talking and banging on the wall when there's nobody checked into that room. And I said, well, shit, check me in. And, and they did stay all night because they passed out. That's amazing. That is absolutely amazing. Mm. Now, Stunt Boy, uh, you're playing with stuff. You, you're over there doing God knows what. As long as you don't leave a mess for Reno next week, that's all that matters. Whatever you put, whatever you put in your pocket, put it back. <laughs> <laughs> hey, pudding cups over there. Been about there for about a month. We are good to go. It's Smedley's Tavern in Hutchinson, Kansas next weekend, Saturday night. So so what what time are you gonna do this? After the bar closes at two thirty in the morning? I I'm I may have to make I may have to make an appearance. You should I may have to make an appearance and wear my uh, pink Somebody. cowboy hat and my uh, leopard print jacket. It will be on Access TV, and and I'll and I'll do some Access stuff, and and I can be on Access now because they let me come back. So uh, <laughs> and now now it's progressed to guys on horses are handing these KK sheets out. Just FYI, awesome. Yeah. Guys on horses. Oh. I went to a town to see a man about a horse. Yeah. And he handed me this damn flyer. About. But uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, what? Yeah. What is this? I this just came to see you about a horse. Now you're telling me you hate black people? What? Did you say how many people are viewing you right now or no? Oh yeah, we've got we've got a couple hundred at least watching so, us on the old U stream. So everybody that's out there right now watching us, add us on uh, Facebook at Central Kansas Paranormal Society, and we will add you right now. We've got. Uh, Stunt boy, the biggest star in the universe. <laughs> Forget about what you've heard. Forget about Ferris and Jello fights. <coughs> Dogs and Sanders. Colonel Sanders. I'm the man, the myth, the legend. <laughs> and uh, he's with us today. <laughs> and uh, the rest of the Central Kansas Paranormal Society, they are uh, hanging out. And uh, so you guys have this hunt at Smedley's. Yeah, you can this Saturday. Then we have um, C. Kinsey or Piper Lou Renee or Oop. whatever her name is. Next week, uh, Reno will be here next she's week. always looking like she's about to drop a hot album all the time. Just she is a perv magnet. If, if you, if you uh, look her up on the Facebook, <coughs> it's Mackenzie Mellerman, I believe. Yeah, and uh, she always looked like her, and uh, and that's fine because 
She's a perv magnet, and I'm a perv. And <laughs> the two, the two I see what you did there. It's always me. <laughs> you know, it's kind of like I was saying the other day about the people with the money and the people that don't have the people with the ideas don't have the money, and the people with the, the people with the money never had any ideas, and they never meet. <laughs> it never happens. <laughs> it just never happens. Oh yeah, he's actually going to be here in a couple weeks, December first. Yeah, I actually I got a, a big city sound here in town, and I run sound for a, a, a numerous stuff. And one of them is uh, Total Action Zone Wrestling out of uh, Hoisington, and Angel is a big part of that right now. He's a uh, Angel Medina man. He's pretty awesome, dude. Big dude, but he. He was in there for a cup of coffee, yeah, probably. Yeah, he took he took on Shane Sanders last time. He was out there at the old. Uh, oh, I guess it's not Sanders anymore. It's a. Uh, or it is. Or, it's the same. I it, don't know. Yeah. Now, um, you guys have this hunt at Smedley's. You guys have uh, anything else coming up besides? Not, not yet. Our the biggest investigation of our career is going to be in March. Um, we're going to the Waver, Waverly Hill Sanitarium. In Kentucky, what town? Louisville, Louis, Louisville, Kentucky. Louisville. And uh, Louisville. Ten of us are going. Of course, we got to pay money for it, but that's. that's what? Well, yeah. um, it's an eight-hour investigation by ourselves, just our team in the building, nobody else. It's a private, private rental. We're renting out the building for thousand dollars. So this wow. place is. To all you people out there listening and watching, check it out on YouTube, man. There's Ghost Hunter's been there. Taps have been there. This place is nuts. Now, those people. Wheelchairs moving by themselves down the hallways. I don't know. So, you've got wheel... What? Hold <coughs> on. Back up. Back the trolley up here. You've got... <laughs> you're going to have... There's going to be wheelchairs moving down the hallway? Yeah, that is our prayer. By themselves. Oh no. no, no. <laughs> There's a video on YouTube of uh There should be a video on YouTube of Stuff Boy in his underwear and I don't know anyone would watch it, but go ahead. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I, sound, I love you, Stuff Boy. It's nothing but love, baby. That sounds like an album cover waiting to have it. <laughs> but I guess the wheelchair supposedly moved by itself and they got it on YouTube, some paranormal team that went in there and I haven't seen it, so I don't know if it's true or not, but that's what the rumor is. I just, I'm amazed by the, uh, the <laughs> I'm just, so have you guys had any, uh, I've always wondered, have you ever had anybody, and I'm sure I probably asked you this, have you ever had anybody, like any of these uh, ghosts and stuff, like attack you or stalk you or anything? Have you ever had any? I have one that followed like, me home. Or they're like, you know, we're going to get these other <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. I don't know if you call it that way, but um, we went and we did the Masonic Temple in at Salina. Oh, I bet that was and, a um, freaking scary place. I've been in there when there's and, lights on. I don't want to be in there. And, <laughs> and, and we believe that there was a, a woman ghost in there named Clarice. We we kind of had the feeling. Clarice. Clarice. Uh, and and. <laughs> And everybody hey, left, and we're around my house, and and, going that way with me. and you know when you <laughs> when you take a shower and it gets hot and it messes up stuff. Yeah. And and then um, I got out of the shower and their name Clarice was written on my mirror, and I called them up and I chewed them out. I said, "What the hell are you guys doing? Are you messing with me?" And they didn't know what I was ready? talking about. Wow. That's, and they're yeah, like, "What are you cute. talking about?" And they said, "Really?" And they did. It was like. I swear sometimes she's Yeah, that would creep me out. I would uh I, I, I would go stay I'm... in the car. <laughs> I'd go stay yeah, in the car. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go to McDonald's. <laughs> I wouldn't be able to do that. That would creep me out. That place, uh-huh. that place was awesome. Nuts. Four people was it four of us? The first time we did that place three times. Uh, four people alone with the every room. Weird. I, I I just don't even know <laughs> what to say. That is just... We're all going to try so many kinds of information on this place that uh, posts on our Facebook that we're going to try to end up 
the uh, spaghetti factory in Wichita. Oh, my God, in Wichita. Holy smokes. And next year, when, and at the same time, I think, what's that? Is it for the museum in Ellis? What is that? They said the callback in Spurs. Uh, hope, hopefully in April, we'll be doing the old railroad museum in Ellis, Kansas. Wow. Supposedly there was a jail cell in the basement and somebody in the 50s drowned. There was a flood and it drowned and couldn't get out. And then I want to try to do, all I know about it. hopefully, uh, the, the old POW war camp outside of Concordia. That, I think, would be... That, we'll find a lighthouse. That would be spooky. <coughs> a what? A lighthouse. Uh, every we time we go, ev- every house. time... Farmhouse. And I don't know why I always get dragged there, but every time I get dragged there by Brittany for a chocolate, she loves a Russell Stover's chocolate. I work there, I can tell you this. It's just... She drags me there constantly. You think that place is haunted? What's the deal with the house on the way there? They're supposedly that place. It's supposedly haunted. It's not on nobody's property. It's just... Just there? Yeah. Yeah. People go out there for like photographers just to get the sunset and stuff all the time. And yeah. Film and stuff. Have you guys ever thought about checking out Coronado Heights? Or I was we've been there. Say that, yeah. Is that we actually have a video on our Facebook page? You have to scroll way down. Of uh, we have a night vision camera recording and a non night vision camera, and we sit a a beer can that just happened to be in there up on the p- picnic table inside. And then I say, if there's anybody in here with us, can you please show us, make something move, knock this beer can over. And about, what, 30 seconds later, like that, yeah. the beer can falls over and spins the opposite way. And we got it on recording. You can see a shadow figure move from the left side to the beer can <coughs> that on video, and it's on Facebook. Man. <laughs> so, yes, Cornell yes. Heights is haunted. So is the little cemetery down below. So, uh, so what, what, what are, what are some places that you've tried to get in and they're just like, nope, yeah. it ain't happening. Get the, out. The books. In fact, we're going to call security. We don't have security, but they're going to show up right now and get you <laughs> out of here. Bookstore in Where, <laughs> the bookstore in Abilene. They said the no. In Abilene. Um, the library here in Hutch. It is haunted. It's proven. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not shocked. <laughs> oh yeah, it's actually Seriously? it's on the long list. There's a list of scariest places and and the I'm, library. I'm, I'm, I'm not one of them. shocked that they had horrible customer service and they're like, wasn't well, it the mental theater in Newton, whatever it was called? Fox and, Theater and in Topeka, the uh, mental. Oh. Yeah, we tried the Topeka Mental Hospital, the old one in Topeka, Kansas. <laughs> but we actually did get permission to do that. Not inside the building, but around the buildings in the cemetery there. We got we just never yeah. went up there and done it. Um, another place that we did get to do, but there was way too many people, was... Uh, What's that? Hotel in Topeka? Oh, Lawrence, Eldridge. Eldridge we did the Eldridge Hotel in Lawrence, Kansas. There was about 200 people in there being noisy, so we didn't get much from there. And we didn't couldn't go in the rooms or anything. Yeah, they wouldn't let us go in any of the rooms. So uh, I I just got a message from Angel. He's going to work on uh, getting this uh, this paranormal hut together with the uh, the wrestlers, and uh, apparently they're doing a WWE house show in January. Yes, in Wichita, and Devon Dudley will be there, and he's going to try to see if we can do something to where maybe either before the show or after the show is an afternoon a, if show. You're, if you're listening, can we get some tickets or something? <laughs> So, uh, so we're going to see if we can make that happen. Uh, let's see. You know, Brittany lives right across the street from a damn graveyard. We, we ought to have you guys go there. I did just, you know that one. Adam loves those. <laughs> Some point loves graveyard. You know that one outside of Salina by uh, Salemsburg? Oh, yeah. church and graveyard right there. Yeah. I got a voice recording the other night. It says, in a real creepy male voice, Leave me. It's actually on my phone. Jesus. How do you guys sleep at night? <laughs> <laughs> One eye open, honey. One eye open. A lot of alcohol. <laughs> when was the last time we were here? Well, 
you know we, we go into oh, it you with, got you it. will you not play harm it. us, you it's will free. not mess right. with us. Of course, yeah. Go to our Facebook page from when we did our Cocker City, Kansas investigation at the Geisler Mansion. We got some pretty good recordings. We got, have you seen Lucille? What sound like an older gentleman? And when I said, whose house is this? He responds back to, this is not your house. And I'm telling you, we had a great turnout for our haunted house. Yeah. And I got another career if I wanted to scare people. Right. Oh, found out I was pretty good at that. Can you tell us your name? Play that, Adam. Yeah, uh, that was yeah. Wow. <laughs> Can you tell us where you're from? Oh no way, dude. Uh uh. <laughs> nope. <laughs> you hear all anything I had in my hands hit the floor, I'd be in the car. That is one hundred percent unedited. telling you he, he'll sit for hours with our our recorder and anything with headphones on just go back does something go back back and back the and back oh <laughs> did you hear this did you hear this? And i'm just like what where and they all explain it to me i'm like oh yeah okay now i'm hearing it yeah that's a hell of a deal well let's wrap up here uh next week we are gonna have a uh, reno she will, she will be here. A beautiful girl. Love her. We will have a Burgess and a guitar. Uh, C. Kenzie or McKenzie or Piper Blue. Hey. I like you guys here. It's really good. Piper Blue. I'm a fan. Probably Bob Hunter because she'll be here. And then we this week as well. We will stop. And he's be here for a little bit. And, uh, so, uh, always do something every week. Uh, that was freezing. Oh my gosh. Like my cable so I wrap up Yeah, I didn't die. 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 Has been a, has been a, what, was it, what was it back in the day, you know? Bernadette has been... I it. Yeah. <laughs> I think I you guys to have a slugger. We ought, we ought to do a deal where the roller, de roller derby team goes with you guys on a hunt. That would be awesome.